Is very, that, very is, hard. Is it, is it not a bit ungracious to bring that up? I mean, refereeing mistakes in every sport are priced in. They it, happen. It, it, it's not ungracious because we have the technology to change that. The technology is here to support our referees. You heard referee Barnes say, I saw the repl replay, I'm sorry. Mm. We have to uh, provide our referees with the technology that we already have and the ability to say, I made a mistake, I'm changing that decision. And he's not allowed to change his mind even though he's seen it on the big screen. That's my understanding. Okay. I, I haven't got the law book in front of me and I have to talk to referees. If that is NFL, if mm. that is the NFL, that's changed. But, and we have to, so, sorry Shane, we have, to, we have to find a way where we're not talking about referees and allow them to get it right. And we, we have it, mm. we're just not empowering it. I don't think it's as simple as, you know, he makes the correct decision there and South Africa win the game um, because there's three points the other, you know, three points knocked off the score by, um, scoreboard. There's something in what Khaleesi said there okay. that, you know, you find a way and champions find a way. And whatever would unfold, you know, you have a different game then, Matt. You do. You, know, you have a different game and, you know, who scores next in those circumstances? And do you, does that mean you kick for a corner? Or, you know, we don't know. That's a completely different game. So I don't think it's easy, as simple as saying that, yes, it had an impact and you, don't, you want to take it out of the game. But I think it was ultimately South Africa found a way to win that game. And, and they did, Shane. And, I, and, and I'm not telling you, this is not about South Africa or even referee Barnes. This is our game. But you've got to have a game that's just. You've got to have a game that delivers justice. And it's not against South Africa. Yeah. They no, were fantastic. On, on, on the same side as South Africa finding a way, New Zealand still had more opportunities to win it too. They did, you know? and they missed their goals. Exactly. But, but so. that three points they got, they shouldn't have been allowed that opportunity. But we can, we can nitpick the whole way through games at, at other calls. Every single game in this tournament, refereeing mistakes. And it, I, I think we have to accept as well that this is the game is to some degree flawed. You know, that it's not, a, it's not a completely exact science. What we need to do is do our very best to remove as many of them as possible out of the game, but understand that referees are human. And, of course and, to, and to help referees, because if, exactly. if, if we don't try and make it easier for referees to do their job, less and less people are going to want to become referees. So can I ask a question? Because this feels like a, I'm not sure this is the right discussion right now as we're watching South Africa celebrate. Are you trying to tell me South Africa won because of the referee? Because that feels like too far a step here. I, I don't know if this is the right place for that discussion. Well, well whether it's the right place or the wrong place, it's a fact. And we, we've got to face that fact. That penalty and should not be an award to South Africa. Oh, we've got so many variables move beyond that. Move on, move on, move on. No, but move on, on. But like, on. Well, let's, let, let's not move on before we say, I totally disagree with that. He said, the referee had an impact in the game on both sides. There's no doubt about it. But, you know, to, just to narrow it down to that one thing, with, with all the time that was passed in the game afterwards and all the different um, um, things that, uh, that could have taken place and did take place after that, I think it's, uh, I think it's unfair. Um, and it does a disservice to South Africa. Did South Africa get another opportunity to score a point? But would they have? Did Matt, they? We but don't did know. They? It's a they different game then. It's they a different did, game. That, those three points were crucial in the game. We can't, but, we can't but, dodge but that. We could have this discussion after every single game of rugby. We could pinpoint one decision that the referee made wrong with the other team scored. Well, my argument again, mate, is we have the technology to change that and we're not using it. That's all I'm saying. Give the referees the technology to get that right. So we don't have the discussion. And is your sense, let's put it this way then, let's say he reversed that decision, they don't get the three points. New to, game. Sh to Shane's point, do you New not game. think South Africa still find a way somehow? New game. You don't think South Africa still find well, a way? Well, who, who knows? They don't, they don't get those three points. Yeah, sure. OK, Sia Khaleesi maybe should have been red carded. Like, there, are, there is not a sport in the world without big refereeing decisions which are contentious and, and even wrong. It's, it's just impossible to eliminate them. I do, I, do, I do think that there's more of them in rugby yeah, than absolutely. any other sport in the okay. world. OK. And, and I think this championship, taking nothing away from South Africa, giving them all the credit they deserve, they fought hard, they were brave, they were brilliant. Mm. This tournament has been littered with that. Littered with... with with uh, refereeing, offici officiating errors, also we, it, it, from the TMOs. Mm. Now, the, thank God the scrums weren't, weren't an issue. They did that well. A lot of the game was, you know, it was tense, it was hard, and, uh, and New Zealand had their opportunities. And